So now we're getting ready to gather the tool. Yay! So we talked about the fact that we have a fancy gizmo before to do our gathering for us. Um, normally you do two lines of stitching and you pull and you get it adjusted right. So this crazy looking thing here is called a ruffler. Because mm -hmm. you can do ruffles or gathers or whatever. So this part of the thing goes, that can you see can move, goes on the part of the machine that goes up and down. Mm -hmm. So the up and down goes on the up and down. And this part that looks... You can see it looks suspiciously just like the thing on what? any other presser mm -hmm. foot. Um, goes around this part. If you have a newer machine, um, it'll be some other kind of gizmo. Hopefully they have something called the ruffler. They've been making sure these things do. for a hundred years. Yeah, because so there's lots of ruffles. A lot of ruffles in old things. There's two adjustments. This thing here has tiny little numbers. Let's see, what's it? One, six, twelve, and a star. I don't know what a star means. <laughs> one, six, means. twelve star. So one means it's going to move the fabric forward every stitch. Okay. Six means every six stitches it'll move the fabric forward. Hmm. So you'd get pleats. Mm -hmm. So you go da 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 pleat da 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 pleat. Oh. And 12 is every 12 stitches, and then it would move it. Mm -hmm. um, how big your stitches are, you'd adjust just like any other stitch thing. And then there's another little adjustment knob down here. You can see this little turny thing. This turny thing, you can see when I move the stitch, it takes this little thing and moves it backward and forward. Oh. How far it moves it forward for each stitch depends on how you have this adjusted. Jeez. There are no numbers on this. Mm -hmm. I wish there were numbers on <sighs> this, but there aren't. And so in order to figure out how much you need to adjust this to get your thing gathered your right amount, depends on where this is at. Usually when I'm gathering, it's twice as much, you know, twice as full as it started with and so it's probably what it said it hmm. but netting gathers differently you just have to try so you find a scrap of fabric okay we measured this the waist of our netting we measured the waist of our dress we cut a piece of netting the same size you wouldn't you could divide it by half you could do math we happen to have a scrap the right size so <laughs> we're gonna go with that All so right. it's easier for us and you feed this thing through. You can see there's lots of different ins and outs and, and bobbles and wiggles on this thing. Yes. Um, this thing can do lots of fancy things. You can gather one piece and have it go on to a piece that's flattened and it'll, it'll sew it to the thing you're gathering it to at the same time it gathers it. Oh my goodness. You can have a... It's got this little thing here. You could have a ribbon on top of your... It can do lots of fancy stuff. We're not going to use all those fancy things. <laughs> There's one thing here, little loop here. It's got a sort of rounded bit on this side um, that sort of stops my stuff from going too far this way. And I'm using that one because that'll keep me a consistent approximately 5 eighths. Which is sort of, Which is sort of what everybody every every video I think I, I think I should find like a mashup and do every five eights every five eights yes. five eights five eights. So now we're gonna it's watch a... the machine in action, All right, let's go. and I'm gonna start out going really slow so you can sort of see what's going on. Action. And it comes out gathered on the other end. That's really cool. So is that every whatever? Because you were saying the numbers. This is every stitch. This is every stitch. Okay. Yes. To get optimum. Uh oh, levels. my needle just flew out. Oh my goodness! What? It was shaking it so much because um this thing works on the needle. This thing goes up and down on the thing that attaches the needle. Gosh, that thing's it, it insane. The needle out. So a reminder to self: tighten that every once in a while. It's going to. It's going so fast. Look at that thing. So way easier to use this than doing it by 
hand. Yeah. Okay, so now we're going to stack all the layers of netting on top of each other before we pin them to the actual dress. Whoa. So I, I want you to give me a pin. They're right there. Thank you. Very good one, though. That's okay. Big long ones are perfect. Yeah, I know, except that it looked like it was not very smooth. I don't care about smooth. We're pinning netting. Yeah. I'm just getting you the big Thank ones. You. The big, big ones. And I'm pinning the um, seams together now just because I will never find them again once we get all our layers together. So, finding seams and netting is difficult, which is a good thing. That means they're not going to show up. That's right. That is good. It's growing bigger. It's growing bigger. Did you pin just at the seams? Yep. The trick is finding the seams. Layers! I'm too Another layer of pink. Mm -hmm. And then we get to add one more layer of white. Yep. And it does almost stand on its own. Is it fluffy enough for you? Well, let's see. <laughs> <laughs> it will be. It's hard to tell what they're just sitting there. Well, you don't have the crinoline and you don't have the other mm -mm. dress. so. It's I like, was thinking you know, it was looking pretty fluffy. So yeah, it's pretty fluffy. <laughs> I couldn't imagine that you would say anything besides oh, I'm sure. absolutely. And I'm then you sure. go, we'll see. And I'm going, I don't think it can be any fluffier. It will be with the crinoline and stuff. That yeah. would make the difference. I know. I'm just saying I can't tell right now. But I'm sure As it will be It's standing all fluffy. by itself. <laughs> well, this is the thing. It's standing it all by itself, and it doesn't even have the other layer. This is the last layer now. Woo! Woo! <laughs> Where's the back? Oh, here we go. <laughs> this back just stuff. Just stand there by it's, itself. It's a lot of fluff. <laughs> What I like. <laughs> so now. Now that's a marshmallow. That is a marshmallow. So now I'm going to take all these jumbly, messy layers <laughs> up top and line them up neatly and sew them together so it'll be a nice flat layer on, you know, so that it can actually be sewn into something. <laughs> that's so a good idea. I'm going to take the pins. There's the poofy. Right there. Okay, so it would have been very, very clever of me <laughs> to have, before I put the layers together, measured each one and made sure that they were all the at least as wide as our waistband, but I didn't. So I had to do some futzing to get it to our needed 33 inches but I got it there <laughs> yay <laughs> so now that we've got all the layers pinned together now we're going to pin them at, or sew them as one unit ah. and because there's a lot of fluff a fluff wrangler is required <laughs> so Rosalie is the fluff, fluff, fluff wrangler Ro La Rosalie the fluff fluff, wrangler. Fluff, 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 fluff. so um so now, and now it's our needed 33 inches, but it's just 33 inches, so I'm going to be pulling it tight as I sew, so that it, and I'm going to actually start a little bit shy of our end, so we can ungather a little bit as needed when we get to this really fun part, which will be dealing with zippers. <laughs> nice. This is going to be a slow process. This is going to be a slow process. But so while you're doing it, you want to like make sure all of your, that you don't have any netting that's pulled up like this. Mm -hmm. You don't want to have to re-sew any of this because you already spent an hour pinning it. And unfortunately, I'm not exaggerating. You know, <laughs> we are. Here we are. We're getting her layers of netting organized, starting with the one underneath the... Uh, Actually, it's 
still too long? Well, we, we knew it was going to be. But right. too long is way better than too short, so yes. we're fine with that. <laughs> okay, princess. Oh Would you gosh. like to turn around so you can see yourself? Yes. Oh my gosh. <laughs>